Episode 330, Daily Fire. Ooh. Consistency and perfection. Consistency. So there's there's two things. If you focus on elite consistency over a perfect plan, I believe you'll win bigger. Let, let, me, let me say it again. Episode 330. If you focus on elite consistency over a perfect plan, I think you'll win. So you could have, in theory, a mediocre plan. Listen to me. A mediocre plan that you follow because it's an actual lifestyle. And you're going to win over what you think is the perfect plan that you can't fucking follow all day. So like people ask me a lot, gee, what's the best diet? Motherfucker, the one you'll actually follow. Gee, what's the best the best workout plan? The one you'll actually follow. So that's why I have all these different varieties of plans. That's why I have multiple varieties of anabolic fasting. Now the busy diet. And we have the old ways we used to eat. Like, which lifestyle, not plan, not diet, which lifestyle can you take a part in? Like, which one can you consistently follow? Like, when I think about these programs, I think about myself in the world, right? You got to remember, I wasn't always this way. Now, I've been crazy talk this way probably longer than I was the other way at this point in my life, now about to be 45. But the reality is, I know what the baseline is, and I know how my life is. And what I had to do was say, how can I take somebody from what their norm is, and they're not going to be probably as crazy as me, but how do I make improve their life, put some guidelines, put some cheating? Like, how does it become an actual lifestyle? You can make progress and still not be an outcast. You can make progress and still like feel like you're living life. It's a hard balance because the discipline that it takes to be, I think, elite health and fitness wise and all that is not easy. And so it's one of those things where like, but what can you follow? And so when I come back to, here's the two things I tweeted. Number one, consistency is a superpower that everyone has access to. I've tweeted this a bunch of times and it's fucking true. Kyle behind the camera, myself, we have access to the same level of consistency. You watching me right now, no matter where you're at in this whole process of losing weight, gaining weight, getting strong, you have the same access as I do. You choose whether you want to be consistent or not. You have the same fucking access that I got access to. Number two, Perfection is a thing that no one has access to. Listen to me. Perfection is a thing that no one has access to because it doesn't exist. So if you're trying to be perfect, you're fucked. I would rather try to be consistent because the reality is everyone can be consistent and no one can be perfect. Think about that. So you're flexing and pushing and won't start things and don't want to start the weight loss till the diet's perfect and don't want to do this till this moon rises over this fucking hill. It's not going to fucking happen. It's never going to be perfect. So what you need to do is say, what can I be consistent in? And so the reason why I believe my plans have been successful worldwide. Up to 80 countries of members on Corey G Fitness, right? I've had thousands and thousands of people all over the world have amazing results. It's because they find a way within our lifestyle to be consistent. They're not going to be perfect, but I teach them the way to get back on track. I give them the tools and the understanding of when they're fucking up, how to get it together. Do you understand what I mean? Drive home consistency. Perfection doesn't fucking exist. The reason why I've beat a lot of my competition is because I just start stuff. I just fucking start it because I'm not scared and because I know it's not going to be perfect. This show right this second is not perfect, but I'm trying my best and I'm executing it. And as I do it, I will get better. Do you understand what I'm saying? So like, think about this. What is can I be consistent on? How can I drive home that? Because at the end of the day, perfection is not really available. Now you can try to push to be great and the best you can, but you're never going to hit that bang. That's perfect. It's just not there. So I just want to reframe your mind is like, I just get things started. I get in the mix. 
I get rolling and I try to drive home consistency. Through consistency, I create momentum. Through discipline and consistent actions, the, the momentum starts to carry and opportunities start to open up. And then because you're prepared, you can execute. Episode 330, we out.